This is like a staple of main man videos where Can like you tell I'm recording for YouTube. Just edit it out, man. Just edit it out. Just edit it out, man. You're gonna have to edit this video. <laughs> this is so easy to do, and I can't do it. Okay, fine. 66 damage. <laughs> you know what? That's just easier. You know, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just. Personally, I don't think... I don't know. Here's the thing. First off, I have to say this is also just a title. I think a lot of people put a lot of stock into titles of videos. When, like... Titles are just there to get you to watch the video and then get into the content. I don't... I mean, I don't know. He also has an XD here, so... XD? Maybe it's tongue-in-cheek. But no, I, I don't... I won't say it's broken. I don't think. Um, But... It's, I, to be honest, I actually have not played against Law at all since they buffed it. At all, it's weird. Um, but personally, I don't think it's bad. What's up, guys? Main man Sui here. Hoping you're all doing awesome as always. And this is going to be a, another video on patch 5.01. And specifically, Law's change, which was uh, DSS stance, can now rage drive. This is kind of busted, actually, How in slow my is opinion, it? and I'm going to explain why. Did it say I is it 24? Did it say 24? Because isn't that 22? And, and it busted, actually, can now rage drive. It's 24. This is, was a DSS stance. Oh, no. Tw oh, the second it was 24. Okay. Because I was going to say if it was 24, 24 is literally this reactable. Is kind of but it was the second hit. Actually, and it, this is the old rage oh. drive. Uh, we have different notations and different properties. Old rage drive comes out. It's safe on block, but it comes out at 26 frames. Right? That is very seeable. Like, uh, pretty much everyone can react to that. So, what happened? Well, from DSS now, you can't do the Rage Drive. This one is different, because this one comes out at 22 frames. Now, what everyone thought this meant first is that, okay, oh, I'll do a string into DSS, and now, from there, I can force a 50-50, right? I do a string, DSS, oh, it comes out at 22 frames. That's unseeable. You gotta remember that at 23 frames, right? You have Heihachi's down back too. When something is 23 frames, that's a very small minority of players who will offline and on a five bar connection, on a perfect connection, they'll be able to see that. What I'll say on that this is Noctis, I think Noctis down back two is slower because I do believe I, I believe Noctis Down by 2 is slower because I react to that more. That's the only reason I think so. Um, but with, I don't know. Here's the thing. Because, <clears throat> like, I don't think, like, you're going to be able to, like, even if something is reactable, you're not. Some, like, if it's not a snake edge, Down by 2, is that Heihachi or Noctis? Uh, down by 2 is 25. Noctis Down by 2 is 24. And then what's um, Heihachi's Down by 2? Ace is 23. So this year, one frame different. So yeah, I was technically right by one frame. Um, but like, I don't know. So here's the thing when it comes to reacting to like lows. So this is what Joe, so when Joker came back from Pakistan, this is what he said the Pakistanis say, how they practice reacting to a low. Is like, because these guys, like apparently like, you know, I was talking to Arslan at, um, I think OTB. He was talking about Hira Malik. And now Hira Malik reacts to literally every single like uh, thing down to every single one like everyone he reacts to and it's a bit of a slow low but like it's every single one low parry low parry block low every single one right he said what the pakistanis do is they go into practice mode and they literally they will block that low like a hundred times in a row like a hundred single times they'll block that low a hundred times in a row that's that low they want to block on reaction they'll block it a hundred times in a row because it's mainly about reacting realizing the animation getting that muscle memory like the moment you see the animation muscle memory kicks in that type of thing so that's what they do for it um like you don't have to mix in other moves or anything like that just that specific low a hundred times in a row in practice mode maybe do that a few times and that's what they do for it i like, know no other moves just that one move because you're reacting to that animation that thing um and that's what they do for it so it's something that takes practice so like when it comes to low level players like reacting to a low all the time i don't think it's that deep the game isn't balanced around that like hey archie's down back two should not be made worse because green ranks have trouble dealing with it 
but I don't think that's what Mayman's saying, by the way. But I'm just like sort of going off there. I actually don't know where I was going with this. Uh, keep talking, Mayman. It's 22 frames. It does not sound like much, but going from 23 to 22, that one frame faster is a hell of a lot faster. And honestly, I don't this think is so. now unseeable in my eyes. Especially I... online where we all play. Even on a five bar, you have noticeable delay. I, I don't think so when I look at that. Like, because here's the thing. Like, I think when you see, because the fact that you're seeing Law go in, because you can see Law do a manual DSS. Um, I think when Law goes into it and then he goes for the sweep, like, I think... I think that's that's actually adding frames to it, you know, him going into DSS. If Law's in Rage and DSS, like, I think you're going to be looking out for a bit more. You're going to be expecting it a bit more. So I don't think it's that much. I don't think manual DSS makes it that much of a problem, honestly. Um, Watch out. No, you can immediately do the Rage Drive. You see, without seeing the stance. So th this is now, for all intents and purposes, an unseeable low hitting rage drive but there's lots does 42 damage the thing right? is there's loads of those and in the game though. from far away there's loads of those in the game though to be honest and it's safe true true it is safe i think that is the difference because yeah like evil said you have lydia's you have facts you have laws those are all unsafe um but even still i don't know but the difference is laws is laws is borderline even I, i'm still not convinced on it being unseeable at this point but i haven't played against a law for me to know you know what i mean if you get devil jins blocked you die because you're yeah i think law rage drive was the worst in the game but then they buffed it by making it safe and then it was the worst race drive in the game <laughs> so down it the game now they've made it faster I think it's probably all the way up to being the worst race drive in the game. <laughs> like, I don't know, like, uh, D-Tech, thanks to follow. I don't think it's, I don't know if it's unseeable, honestly. They should have made a plus on block like Warring's, but like Warring's is different because like, the last year of Warring's race drive only hits if like you walk forward or you don't block for some reason. You know, it's all about blocking. Warring's race drive is all about blocking that last hit. And getting your mix up. Um, Law's rage drive is just like you want to just. They get hit by the first or the second, it's a combo, and you want to take that damage. So I don't know. Like, Jack's rage drive is not seeable. Like, I think Jax is fucked up. Because the difference with Jack. I don't. Did he make a video about Jax? Because I think Jax is way worse. Because Jax doesn't come out of stance. He just has to do a different input now. You know what I mean? Um. Laws is just from DSS, and I think the fact they come from DSS makes it. I don't see that as a problem, honestly. But I haven't played against Law right now, so I need to. I need to play against Law and find out. Did Jax rage? Out? Yeah. If you do, if you do debug one plus two instead of one now, it comes out two frames faster. So he still has the old one. Anakin doesn't plant the seed like fifteen of the time he attempts the new one. Yeah, Anakin does the new one now, but it makes sense. The Yoki's better. Why? I don't know. They buffed a lot of lows. They buffed a lot of lows at one point, which I think they just go, they want to balance the game in the direction of like, look at these power lows. Look at how fantastic they are. Look how exciting this makes the game. You know, Katarina's down back three. Uh, Leo's was it down forward two plus three. They buffed lows like that just because, you know, they made them faster for some reason, which is like, we want these power lows to hit. Look how exciting. Look at the sparks that they create, you know? But yeah, I. Mm -hmm. Can Warring punish Cat slow now? No, he still can't. He still can't do him while setting three. Oh my god, okay. Just wanna demonstrate what this looks like. This is like a staple of main man videos where Can like- you tell I'm recording for YouTube? Just edit it out, man. Just edit it out. Just edit it out, man. I have to edit this video. <laughs> this is so easy to do, and I can't do it. Okay, fine. 66 damage. <laughs> you know what? That's just easier. You know, that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to do Ford Ford Free Bear. It does 60 damage either way. Uh, so
so uh, yeah, I, I hope I've, I've I've done that before though. I think I've mentioned I'm gonna edit something out, then I forget to edit it out in a video. So like, oh man, that's funny. I'm only laughing because that's a content creator like struggle. You do it all the time. It clear why this is very very strong. So now when he's in rage, his comeback utility is through the goddamn okay, roof. So unseeable low that does 42 damage, wall splats from a mile away, and for some reason it's still safe on block at minus nine. It has the same block frames as the old one. But it's All right, what I'll say on that is Ganryu's. I think Ganryu's is reactable as well, and Ganryu's is unsafe. It should be unsafe. It should number. It should be unsafe. I think it should definitely be unsafe. Um, because Ganryu's I think it's also reactable and that is unsafe. I'm thinking you can always you can always low parry, but like if you block it, like I think the only one that isn't universal, I think the only low rage trap besides this one that isn't universally unsafe is Ling's, because Ling is like what it's like minus thirteen. You have like thirteen frames to do something before she can just roll away, um, something like that. I don't know. I never see Ling's rage drive. That means you just don't see Ling. They use it all the fucking time. And Ling's is also unreactable. I think Ling's is fucked up because it's unreactable. It's a full mix up when she goes back turn. Um. But like with law, hmm. Mm. To be honest, and I'm also speaking from my perspective because like I block a lot of lows. So to me, to me personally, that I don't see this as a problem for now. Until I play against law and I see, okay, this is fucked up. I don't really see it as a problem. I think he when he goes into manual DSS and has rage, you just have more reason. I think you, there's a reason to duck laws when he goes into DSS anyway. It just gives you even more reason. Yeah, the mids get stronger, but the mids... He doesn't have a safe mid from DSS, does he? Um, DSS 2 is a high. DSS forward 1 is what? Minus 13, 14. So, they're just, he's just... Yeah, the mids get stronger, but they're unsafe anyway, so... It's seeable. So no one's ever gonna do... Look, this is homing, but I, I didn't mention stepping. You know? Yeah, forward one is safe-ish because of pushback, but like I think I still think for the most part. But I don't think it being homing is a problem, honestly. Do the old one, they might as well remove it because now you'll manually do DSS and go into a 22 frame um, rage drive. So th this is already really, really problematic. But that should not be also based. But, but everything he's saying, like Jax is worse. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? With everything he's saying, I think Jack's race drive is worse. Because Jax is two frames faster. Jax is completely safe. Jax also does chip at the wall. And Jax, but Jax doesn't come out of stance. You know what I mean? Like to me, that I look at, I think Jax, the buff to Jax is way worse. Jack has the most broken race drive. Like I don't know if he's, I don't know if he's spoken about Jax. That's the thing I don't know if he's spoken about Jax. Um but I just I think Jax is way worse. Basically homing. I mean it is it, it is fully homing. It, it's even you know, it, it has the trail. <laughs> I'm sorry, Adam. And the reach can't be understated, right? Look at this reach. So basically now when uh, have fun now when you face law because now when he's in rage he'll be able to threaten you from this range like 2.8 2.7 2.8 with this back free right now I no yeah i didn't again. i i, I think Jax was even difficult to block in the first place i didn't see Jax as fully reactable you know but here's the thing it's like i don't know but here's i think the reason why this is also a problem as well is we all know about three bar law players. This is when this is obviously going to be a problem. So, so this is safe due to pushback. This back free. This ho this is homing mid knockdown. So from this range, you can't sidewalk me, and from very far away, boom, safe. Or I'll do this one. I mean, why are you sidewalking from range two anyway? So, uh, he's fifty fifty now when he's in rage absolutely ridiculous everyone should be right. dashing forward and mashing from absolutely there what the fuck absolutely ridiculous so i just 
can't see this stay the way it is. You can't. You can't have an unseeable. Uh, how do we? How do I even explain this move? You can't have an unseeable low that does 42 damage and wall splats and is homing and has evasiveness and has uh, 2.7 distance reach uh, safe. That can't be safe. Th this is a perfect low. It's, it's just perfect. You, you, you can't have this be safe. It can't be minus nine. That's broken. Th this is this is busted. Sorry, it's sorry. Main man's chat's funny because I see someone chat say backlash 2.0, and by main man's own admission, backlash is completely reactable. So I don't want to get into that. Um, but anyway, like I don't know because like I just think of Jack's rage drive first because Jack's doesn't come out of stance. Only thanks to follow. Jax doesn't come out of stance. Lord DSS, is, is a, he has to go into stance to do it that fast. And I guess he can do manual DSS pretty fast, but like I can still react to Lord doing that. You know what I mean? But that, that's, that's, I don't know if that's just a personal thing. I don't know if I'm, because I'm mainly talking about myself and me, how I feel about it. You know, I don't know like on the, on the, the grand, the grand scheme of things. Any other moves in the game with that many properties? Jack's Rage Drive. You know? And like, Rage Drives in this game in general are bullshit, let's be honest. I don't think Laws, Laws is a candidate for one of the most fucked up because, that, yeah, like, yes, it is safe, which I think uh, it should be minus 11, minus 12 um, to be in line with other Rage Drives like this. But then again, they all come from stance when they're this fast. Fax one comes from stance minus 12. Uh, Lydia's comes from stance minus 12 or 13. Lars's comes from stance minus 12. Um, Jax doesn't come from stance and is safe. I think that's a problem. Um, but Laws come from stance and is safe. I think to be in line with the others, it should be unsafe. It should be. Um, I just don't see it as a huge issue. Oh yeah, Gamrius doesn't come from stance, but is minus 12, thir 13, I think, before he can really do anything. Um... I think Jax is, is definitely a bigger problem with that being faster. Like, when, when he's in rage now, he's just gonna... Every mid is gonna be for free. Because anytime, he can, he can just throw that shit. You have to low parry it, right? Yeah, but it's, again, it's unseeable. So he's gonna mix you up, say. I think the only thing is like make it unsafe. So I think the reason they didn't make it unsafe is because they didn't like when they make frame changes to move, sometimes they forget to change the end product. You know? Um but yeah, that's the thing. Law Law was a good character anyway without a rage drive. I think that was but the thing is the same was for Steve. Steve in season one was a very good character. He just he didn't have that combat potential. Like, oh Steve strikes make combat, he doesn't have the launches. So they fixed it and they were like, fuck, he just, just gave him the best rage up in the game. Um, and we saw that with what that did to Steve for a few seasons. So that's why I thought like we never really needed to buff Jack or buff Law in that way. Um, but yeah, I don't, I don't see, I don't see it just yet, but I need to play against Law more and Rhyme. I think the reward he gets out of his rage up is kind of what Law? I mean, like different rage ups have different purposes. You know, Huarang's rage up, I always mention it, is getting getting that last, getting a few hits from the first two and then going to your plus frames for the mix-up at the end. Um, and that's it. Steve rage drive, you hit. And if it hits, you get your launcher. If you're not, you get your another mix-up. Like, that's what a lot of rage drives are like in this game, which I don't like. You know, you block it, and you get another mix-up. It hits, you get a lot of damage. Like, there's so much reward out of it. Laws is all about just getting the hit, I guess, now. You know? Get the 40 whatever damage from the from the low followed into walk on boy that's what it's about like if you block it you know it's your turn again do whatever the fuck you want but like yeah um someone said someone tried to spell go sane and uh, spelled it gussion 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 gotta be really happy about this just <laughs> bro who the fuck is gussion man who the fuck is gussion oh my god <laughs> 